All right, I hope it's recording. Good morning, Rex family, and welcome back to our channel. Right now it is about 4 o'clock, and I am just starting my day. So here's my stomach for y'all. As you can see, um, baby has dropped. So she is pretty low. Um, so for instance, today what we're going to be doing is inducing labor. We're going to try five different things to induce labor. It's going to be like green tea or raspberry leaf tea, the castor oil, Russian method, walking, running, a little bit of everything. So as of right now, I am going to wash my face, put my hair up, kind of get ready, kind of get clean, like get ready for myself because when you're at my stage, you are just so ready for the pregnancy to be over. I'm just so done with it. I am tired all the time. I'm one centimeter and 50% of phased. So if this were to work for me, you would know that this is around the stage that I was at. So I'm going to get started on washing my face and getting ready for the day. And then, yeah, I'll tune back in then. All right, sure. So, got done, washed my face, kind of like brushed my hair, put an outfit on, and yeah, so I'm gonna go downstairs, see what Alan's doing, and see where we're going next. Finished. This is how it'll be for now. <sighs> He's putting stuff in my car. car God, dude, you had a whole bag of. Dude, you had left Popeyes in there that spilled everywhere on your seat. You hear this? Yeah, you guys hear this? That's how irresponsible she is with her car. You know, it's called working in your car. Alright. So update for you guys, we got a notification on the phone saying that we get $3 for every delivery, like a bonus. For Postmates. For Postmates. Let's clarify, they don't know what you're talking for, about. Okay, <laughs> for Postmates. So instead of going to the park today, because that's what we were going to do to induce the labor, we're going to work a little bit, but we're still going to be inducing the labor, we're still going to try to do that. But instead we're going to go and do Postmates so we can make a little bit of money. Yeah. Um, we think that's what's best. Because so. today's bonus this is the first time we've ever seen this bonus. You get $3 every delivery. And also, they said there's another bonus. You make 60 deliveries, you're guaranteed 360 bucks. Which is really good. Well, it's just cool. But you know Postmates throws in little sneaky little tactics. So we'll see. <laughs> so that's going to be our plan. We're still going to take you with us to the store when we go and grab what we need. We're still going to vlog with you guys today, but we just wanted to update you guys so you know yeah. that. All right, y'all. Stay tuned. The bike. Skirt, skirt. Why don't we go bike riding today? You want to go bike riding? Really? At 37 weeks pregnant? Yeah. No. Why not? Because the baby might pop out. Wait, go grab that bike and let's bike ride down the I can't, dude. My stepdad's seat, dude, I can't even get on it. And I don't know how to Lower alter it. Dude, I don't know how. So uh, we, we ended Postmates early. Our head is banging. Uh, she's she got a really bad migraine right now, so we stop at Safeway. We about to get some stuff for whatever she wants. Whew. Tell tell everyone what you're experiencing. My back is hurting and my head is hurting all at once. Yeah, that's. And, the sun is way too bright. and you know the thing is, I'm starting to get a headache. a headache too. So guys, pregnancy pains for your girl is real, man. It's real. All right, guys, so I am just about done with spaghetti. So we're gonna have some spaghetti. That's my cat. She's really, really horny. She is going through heat. Come here, Lisa. Um, so we got raspberry zinger. So this is, they say raspberry leaf tea makes is induces labor so I have some raspberry tea here I don't know if it's the raspberry green tea leaf so I cannot tell you if it does work or not all I know is I did a little bit of workouts 
Um, got a little bit crampy. Um, nothing really serious. So I'm just trying to really induce it. I also have some pineapple right here and I'll be taking some castor oil shots. So I'm just gonna open this, see how it smells. Um, Okay. It smells really strong like raspberry. So I don't know if you... Ooh. Not sure if I'm going to like this. Let's see. So I must be stupid is... This is one tea bag, I assume. So it says to pour in this. So we're gonna pour that in. And I'll tell you guys what it tastes like. I'll show you guys what Alan's tea is, cause he got his own. So it's not just all any kind of- Alan got this kind, he got, uh, which makes it sleepy, so. my hot water I'm now gonna put my tea in there um, I'm just gonna let it soak in there a little bit it actually smells really good I know that's condescending myself because I just said that it didn't taste good but or it didn't smell good but in the water it did so Looks like it's working, so we have tea. We're gonna try the tea tonight. We're trying everything tonight, so we've done some working out. Probably do a little more working out for a little bit. Gonna set this here, get Alan's stuff ready, and then I'm gonna come back once I start drinking it and I have my food and everything ready because I'm just gonna sit down and do it all. Perfect, so I will be mixing that with some pineapple and Alan's gonna do it with me. Hell no. Cause he's pregnant too. Hell no. Okay. Come here. Вот так, сидеть. Садись. Okay guys, so now we are down to the actual part of inducing like the fun part. So this is how much of the tea I've drank. She didn't like it. I liked it better than her. I didn't like it. Um, I'm not a big tea. Wait, Mike, is that on? All right, turned it on. Oh. Mike's on. I made sure of it. False alarm, sorry guys. So right now we have the pineapple chunks. So we have it in the chunks and now we're just gonna, oh, I wanna drink some castor oil. And this is the castor oil that we, just whatever was in our house. Ew. Now, mind you, when I was like 16 weeks pregnant. Dude, that sound nasty. Bro, bleh. I just peed. Ew. So, it's like this much. It's like I'm going to be taking sh a shot, really. Um. going to be me. Okay, so I have one tablespoon. Of what? Um, I'm gonna do three tablespoons of castor oil. Now, like I was saying, when I was 16 weeks, Alan's mom made me take castor oil because I could not poop. <laughs> and you she did not know that you're not supposed to do that. Why? Because it, it, it induces labor. So, there's one, two, now it is a laxative and I noticed today that I had diarrhea, so. Be ready for me to hear the toilet explode. No. <laughs> so there that is. So now we're just gonna. I'm gonna get you a napkin, dude. Man, I swear, some pregnant woman are so messy. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. 
know. Here, 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 here. Put that down. Yeah, I know. You're getting it all over the table. Oh, boo-hoo. I can clean it up. Yeah, boo-hoo. My mom's going to beat your ass. Oh, my gosh. As long as I clean it up, she's okay. You're just smearing oil all over the table. Okay. Okay, so. You ready? Here, I'll cheers with you. I'll, I'll... I don't know if I can. Don't think I can. You can. I don't think I can. I'm sorry, but. Come on. What, are you going to throw up? Dude, you wanted to do this. She wanted to do this. <laughs> You're gonna mix it up some more? Dude, you're dripping it all over you, baby. Oh my gosh, that's because oil and water don't mix. Yeah. It's supposed to be, it says on here, odorless and tasteless. How long has this castor oil been here? This expires. Okay, it expires. The thing it says August 20th, or like 2020. So smell it. Does it smell odorless to you? Oh uh, no, it smells like oil. So. Here's body armor if you need it. I'm just gonna plug my nose for me. Okay. This is gonna be our clickbait photo. Wait, wait, let me get in it. Okay. Okay. Keep plugging it though. Oh, I'm so scared. You got this. I don't know if I can do it. You got this. <laughs> I don't know. Come on. Okay, ready? Yeah. Just sit, do it. Okay. No. Oh okay. my god, she's a, she's <laughs> a, a fucking pussy. <laughs> um, I don't know how to bleep that out. Okay, we're just gonna try it again. Ready? One, two, plug my nose. Help me out. We just try a sip. Okay, gosh. We're gonna try a sip. So. Actually. That's not too bad with the pineapple. It actually is not terrible with the pineapple. I'm what does it taste like? It just tastes like oily pineapple. Dude, just do it. You're good. Okay, dude, plug it again. Dude, you don't need plug, a... Plug, oh, plug. my gosh. Pregnant women. Just do it. Okay, one. Why are you closing your eyes? Because I can't at all. Yeah, it's not that bad, huh? Keep it plugged. Oh, my gosh. You said keep it plugged. What? I feel like I just chewed lipstick. Okay, help me out. One more time. Oh my gosh. Such a... Inducing labor right here, folks. I will put the products away. I'm gonna throw up. You are? You need a bucket? Give me a napkin. A napkin? Guys, shit is hitting the fan right now, you guys. No one told me that I had peep spaghetti sauce all over my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my final review on that. If I don't go into labor and I just end up pooping, I'm going to be pretty upset. So, let's hope that works. Now it's time to eat this pineapple juice. I'm gonna try to eat it, okay, and I'll pause it. What happened? She threw up. She threw up, guys. She threw up all her spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Now she's cold. Are you gonna throw them, show them my throw up? No, you flushed it. I know. You went over to the bathroom. I know. I wanted to show him, but... And I'm contracting. I'm having contractions. And they're starting to hurt. All right, so the doctor came in, and what does she say? It, we know it's early labor, but it's a matter of time. So if right now they can see that I'm having contractions, so they know that the contractions were real. If my cervix is softening, then they're going to keep me for another two hours, and if it's softening again, they're going to 
She didn't like say what she's gonna do after that. Yeah, but basically, yeah, if her cervix is softening, they're gonna keep her for two more hours to monitor. Um, if it's not, then they're gonna send us home so we could be comfortable and she could be comfortable at home, and then we just monitor from there. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah. Last time it, I got to see her for a very little bit before she moved and was like, okay. she was gone. These ultrasounds aren't as good as the fancy, like, formal ones, but we'll see what we can see. I think this is the right around the same one I got, too. Okay. Alright. Let's first find baby's head. Baby's head is very low. I'm trying to see. That's an eyeball. That, like, dark circle. Oh, wow. Sometimes it's hard to see their face when they're so low. 